Turbo Trading with Head Trader Robert Knight, MBA. This is a video on uh, the beaten down tech stocks that I mentioned, I've written about. And uh, the date is 28th of January 2022, uh, option expiration date. Um, we, we talked about this earlier, about this, uh, the SPX. And a five wave move down, here's your wave one, bounce wave two, sharp wave down, wave three, bounce into four. Now, do we get a truncated fifth and it goes, or does it roll over and trade down to the 40, 50 level? <clears throat> um, here's your key support for it right now. It needs to stay above that level. But if it does change here and we do get a, a you know, a rebound in the markets, then we should see, you know, we should start to see some of these uh, growth stocks that have been absolutely crushed uh, bottom and turn the other way. And this is the kind of opportunity that we're looking for. This is where you make the huge money is, is catching these stocks coming off the bottom and off a big bottom, not just a, a, you know, a dip. So let's have a look at some of the stocks that we, I have highlighted here. Um, AFRM. This is down on support at 50. This came from, uh, 160, 170 area. And, I mean, this is a terrible chart, and it still is. But if it can bounce it, if it can hold support here at 50, and, you know, maybe start to turn up and go, you know, there's room for this thing to move quickly to 80, 100. Uh, DLO. Now, this stock is actually broken down below the 30 and now into 25. So there's no reason to be looking to buy this yet. Um, you know, it has to find a bottom in here. It's in a big downtrending channel. But these are most, a lot of these are the uh, um, software infrastructure stocks. Uh, GLBE. This also, I mean, this uh, specialty re retail, 24 and 30, 36. Maybe we'll see what happens if it gets down in that area. Um, it has double bottomed here around 29 for now. Let's see if it holds that and bounces off it or not. Light speed. This just continues to sell off. Um, I mean, look at these things. If this one came from 130, it's now. Let's call it 30. It's down 100 bucks on 130. That's about 80 percent, 78.32 percent. Uh, but continues to sell off here. Maybe it double bottoms. We'll see if we can. You know, if the markets can find some kind of bottom here, you know, you've changed around. There's an opportunity here to make some big money on, on these things going back the other way. Um, MQ, traded close to 40, now 10, software infrastructure. There's no bottom for that one yet. It doesn't look like it. Okay, TA, also software infrastructure. I mean, this made the death cross up here at 240. This is down from 300, 292. Now 180. About 100 bucks, not quite 100. Bucks, not quite 100. 35%. Big pullback. Okay, TA. SE, this one, this is down from 400, 380. Now one, you know, traded to, well, it's at 130 from 380. That's 150 bucks drop, 40%, more than that. Yeah, above 40%, call it that. I mean, this still has could go a long ways to the bottom. This still could go a ways, too. So it's not looking to buy it any anytime soon, but if we get a turnaround, or if you know if we do enter into a bear market, 
these will even sell off further, but that'll bring us lots of opportunities. This one I'm surprised at. This is where they announced that they did get their charter, and we did trade this a bit. Pop, but look at this now down to 10. It's, if it break trades below this number here, it's going, who knows, maybe to 5. If it does, though, what of an opportunity to take it back to 25. Even if it went from 5 to 13 or 15, that would still be a 200%. So we'll keep an eye on that one for sure. TOST um, from 60 to 20. 68% drop. Never even got a, had a chance to go. Double bottom, double top, and then boom. Watch for a bottom. Twilio. Uh, this is pretty good technology, Twilio. Force 50, now 185. $270. Is sixty percent, not quite. You know, maybe see what happens around one hundred and fifty. I mean, they're not going to go straight back up, but if they, you know, if they pulled up, I mean, look where this thing traded back in at the bottom of the pandemic at seventy, seventy to five hundred. <clears throat> No software application again from 400 to 230, 170, 43%. CRWD CrowdStrike. Infrastructure again. It's in a big downtrending channel, but maybe one, two, three, four, maybe one more like down, five. It's come from 300, now 160. MNDY from another software stock from 400 to 187. This is close to, you know, the, uh, when there's the, the very bottom there. Let's see if it holds that level. Here's another support level, support resistance right there. Uh, this PLTR, this was a, one of ARC's uh, ARC investments, darlings, <coughs> but it it just continues to sell off. Had a high of 45, 46, now 12. Eighty percent. Uh, CFLT. Maybe finding some support in here, at this 58 area. Software infrastructure again. Another software stock, DDOG. From 200 to 120. Unity Software from 200 over 200 to 90. Uh, this uh, Zoom Info from 80 to 40. Key support probably down here around 37. 
38. Could be a good entry for it. We'll see. From 12 to 5. <clears throat> And the last one I was watching here is S, Sentinel-1, cut in half from 38 to, no, from 78 to 38, 50% pullback, not quite. They're all liquid too. So we'll keep an eye on those, you know, those, there's some ideas for us and if they start to go then if the market turns, we'll be we'll have lots of good ideas here that we can that we can take. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Reach new levels of trading proficiency. Become a member at TurboTrading.biz.